Happy birthday, by the way. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. You know how I can tell that white people are evil? White people now. Yeah. uh, Because the sun that gives life to everything on earth tries to kill you. Yeah, we keep going. (laughs) (laughs) We don't stop. We run shit. <laughs> that's how I know. The, that's how I know the clouds are racist. <laughs> They're trying to block you. <laughs> Go to Thailand. Hang yourself. Suicide. Let's do it. Let's, yeah. let's get into it. Let's talk about it. So in high school, I came up with the idea of uh, if I was going to de- commit suicide, I would shoot heroin underneath a, like one of those fucking overpasses they got in, Oha- in uh, Oklahoma. <laughs> right? you know, what? Oklahoma overpasses, like the ones people use as shelter during the tornadoes, right? So I'd shoot heroin underneath one of those fucking things, <laughs> right? As And then walk out and then try to walk out like all limp and high, like super fucking high on heroin for the first time in my life. Like, yeah. Like maybe on the border of an overdose. Some tell me. walk right into the tornado and see if I could fly. I guess if the women play a soccer game in the state, the women's U.S. team plays a soccer game in New York, they have to get paid the same as much as the U.S. soccer team does if they play in New York. So if the New York so- U.S. soccer team puts on an expedition so you in just, Yankee Stadium. So you just uh, signed a bill preventing the women's soccer team from playing in New York? Is that what you're saying? Because <laughs> there's so many atoms or something like that. It's very dense. Whoa, we're right in the face. <coughs> Dude. <coughs> that's the kind of thing. I'm sorry. Chi- that's the kind of thing a chick does in a movie when she wants to fuck a bad boy or something like that. Pat, you can't. You, you're not gonna get to 145. And if you did, you were so depleted. I would just push you over. You would Dude, fall over. You or you can't. You listen. If you give me 24 hours, I'll put on six pounds in 24 hours. That means I'll be at 150, 151. I can put on six pounds in 24 hours. Believe that. Believe it. Who said anything about? So I'm gonna be in the ring. So I'm gonna weigh in at 145, and then I'm gonna be in the ring at 151. And like 151 Bacardi, I'm going to knock you the fuck out. You want 24 hours to replenish? Yeah. You think I'm just going to weigh in and then box you? No. 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 Okay. Well, if you're going to replenish, then yeah, let's do it at 135. <laughs> fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> now you just now you just run away. I'm not going to replenish. You're running, <laughs> now you just run away from me. Like I believe most people, like most people believe they're average, right? They think they're average intelligence. They think they're average fucking good looking. They think they're average fucking good driver. You know what I mean? They all just think they're average. Everyone's middle class in America, right? <clears throat> but the, for me, when I see people get caught up in this this mindset of like, oh, it's because they're just holding down the women and not doing invest, like really looking at the numbers, because the numbers never numbers usually don't lie. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. I mean, you can be manipulated, but at the end of the day, revenue, especially when it comes to revenue and paying taxes on things, that, those numbers are usually pretty close to accurate. Unless, you, oh man, I'm thinking a whole <laughs> by myself on that one. I'm just thinking about like GE and Amazon as I say that shit. I, what I, what I should point out, yeah, is that if at any moment it seems like I'm not paying attention or that I'm not really understanding what you're saying. It's it's because I'm high. Oh, okay. It's not because, hey, bro, was being disrespectful. You, this is me all, getting off the bar stool and fighting you <laughs> at 145, dude. This isn't me trying to train. I know. That's why you I was fucking like, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was so offended that you even say this to me. Like, I'm fucking getting drunk every night and I fucking have bad knees. And you're fucking, you know what I did for this country? Which I would still do <laughs> if you didn't wait 145 and then we got in the ring right there and then. Of course. I would fight you absolutely in a heartbeat, dude. So if I feel up to, so if but I if, wait, you wanna, so if, on, if you want to, hold on, hold on, you want to go, all right, this, I'm, I'm gonna go, and this. then I'm gonna go eat fucking steak, no. and then I'm gonna drink let, let fucking me, eight me, gallons of water. Let okay. me clarify. Let me clarify this. Then you saying this to me? If I weigh one forty five and I feel fit and ready to to box you, I don't give a fuck if you feel fit. If you step on the scale, says one forty five, I'm gonna punch you in the back <laughs> of the head. <laughs> as soon as I see 145. Fuck you, that's dirty. You <laughs> fucking dirty <laughs> motherfucker. What the fuck? Yeah. This place was a mess. Anyway. Mm. So, Raul Sanchez, um, you were here today to testify on the behalf of the Communist Party. How do you say? Well, our leader is uh, Pat Smith, <laughs> a um, egregious homosexual. <laughs> egregious. 
Uh, what does that even mean? Like I'm egregiously <laughs> homosexual. <laughs> like is that in terms of sexuality? Like how I'm laying it down as a man on another <laughs> man, or in like in the terms of like how I interact with people, or what my belief system is? Like oh, I just fucking egregious about fucking being gay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I I thought it would insult you. Apparently it didn't. No, it just I inspired it me to ask a bunch of stupid questions. Like what the fuck kind of SAT word is this stupid Mexican trying? Through at me. 